Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, this is gonna be for my air. This is gonna be for my air. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Do, 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 do. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. What do we got? What do we got? Current energy, next couple days. I explained that in the other videos. And welcome, welcome, welcome. So, it's, it's current, but everyone absorbs energy differently, right? So, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. You got the world. Something's over. But a new door gets still open. And the devil. So it looks like you made a right decision. Nine of Wands is definitely heavy, heavy in the tower. Holy moly. Goodness gracious. Great balls of fire. You shake my nerves and you rattle my brain. Don't let this rattle you. Don't let it rattle you. Something's over. It's it's not it's not good. Troops. I, I hate to be the bearer of bad news. Let this go. You got the world and the tower and the devil. It's a finality. It's done. It's over. It's a wrap. I really hate to say it like that, but when the tower and the world come out together, there's no going back. Lay the weight down. I don't know if you're still fighting for it, but I, I certainly would not. You're fighting for the devil? You have, it's toxic. Let it be, let it be, seeking words of wisdom, let it be, for realsies. I know, it's probably painful, I feel you, I really do, let this go. You got whimsy, so the new door that's going to open for you, Troopaloopas, is bomb, bomb. And then you got the ten of wands, I just said that, let it go. Let this go. This person, this energy around you is weighing you down. Could be dealing with an earth sign. It doesn't matter. Fire. Nine of Wands. Page of Swords. Stop seeing what this one's up to. It's, it's done. Benito. Okay. It's like you want to communicate or you're waiting on communication. Stop. You're dealing with a stick figure. Okay. Tower. Now you got a brand new stat. Okay. Whatever went down, I'm sure was painful. But you have a brand new stat. I, I think every sign got this. I know water just did. I know fire. I think they all did. Um, I don't know about Earth, but it is whatever this new stat is. Oh man, it's it's nice. You could be dealing with a Taurus. If you're going to have a new start with somebody, there might be a Taurus. Because that whimsy was on the Hierophants. Okay. So let's go one more round. Five of Wands. So it's almost like, what? oh, this is tough. There's, it's like, you ended, it ended in an argument. You're dealing with a gentle energy. Someone's gentle. There's something mystical and magical. I don't know if someone took someone for granted. Got the Knight of Wands. So somebody wants to deliver a message. Whether it's you or them. But again, it's the Knight of Wands. That's somebody who's in and out of your life. There's nothing solid here. Six of Cups. So it's someone you know. But it's like, you can't get your mind off of somebody. But it's it's not a good scenario. And then with the fool, the six of pence. So it's <coughs> wanting to, wanting synergy or getting synergy or getting a gift. It's like someone was drowning. You got a couple of different energy here, and energies here, Trooper Loops. Something's definitely over for you to have a brand new start. If someone needs to to go, 
balance the situation out, I I suggest you do. I don't know if you're worried about an argument or worried about someone looking at you as being in or out. I don't know if somebody else was in the picture. But all I know is that whatever is the past, let the past be. Let it be. It's, it's over. It's a finality. Stop fighting for something in the past. There's a new connection. There's a new, there's a new opportunity. You got to take a risk. Pull your best advice. Stop fighting. So, because this is your best advice for you. So, you're fighting. You're fighting change. You're fighting a scenario. Or there's just, there's arguing, fighting, like stop. There's there's something beautiful, okay? So let there be a break a breakthrough. Like there's stress at the bottom of the deck clinging to the past. That's that's a given. Let the past go. It's, it's dead and gone. I, I hate to say it. You got something new though. It's like you need to embark on a new journey and it's like you're fighting it. But you have this one energy, my my air, okay, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. It is a powerful energy. You can create a breakthrough. You can create balance. So it is really, it's really up to you to make moves. And it's not with the past. It's the finality. There's no going back. If you're trying to make the past work, it won't. It's gone. There's, there's new energy here for you, especially with the fool, and it's whimsical energy, it's spiritual, it's, it's dainty, it's, you know, it's delightful. Just a spoonful of sugar helps the medicine go down. But it's like, you don't want to, it's like you got a lump in your throat, you don't want to swallow it. Yeah, you need, someone needs to swallow some pride. There's, there's definitely something for sure. So it's, again, ultimately it's, it's on you. Saw my ear signs. What direction do you want to go? Because if you're going to continue to fight for something that's over, I mean, it's going to be over anyway, and then you lose new. Okay? So, you know, you you think it would be an obvious, but... You know? Play your best advice with this deck. Best advice, leave a Gemini Aquarius. Aquarius. Yeah, let it go. You got the lovers too, so it's like I, I, it's like you're holding on to something that's dead. It, but to me, you know there's something new and whimsical. But you're still holding on to, to something that's inevitably over. It's the world in the tower. It is inevitable that there's a relationship or a marriage or something that is done, it's, it's gone. This would resonate to you if you knew there was a new, a, a new start, a new person, a new journey. Y you would know. It's the fool. You had a taste of something. You know? So... It's, you know, let it, let it go. I mean, guys, dang, I forgot. It's the devil again, laying the weight down. See, it's like lay the weight down. Like uh, enough's enough. You know, it's like even wanting to make it work with somebody from the past with the six of cups, whether you're in a relationship or marriage, however it goes down for you, it, you can't, it's over, it's, it's taken. I don't, don't know why it, karmic, karmically it's, it's, it's taken, it's a wrap. You know, um, and then you got this, this new energy where it's like you can go and create and there can be synergy. It's whimsical. It's dainty. It's, it's refreshing, actually. Okay. So 
ultimately, if, if you want to keep fighting what is inevitably going down with this relationship or whatever this toxic situation is, then that that's on you. It's just like repeating cycles over and over to, to get nowhere. You know, it's like you got this new start here. It, it's fresh. You had a taste of it. So my best advice would be take it. Stop. Stop fighting it. You can create the breakthrough. It, it's, it's letting this go. It's, it's past pain that doesn't even exist. If you're still feeling pain, it, you're being, it's being carried on. You know, it, it's a good chance you're still dealing with somebody who you're constantly bickering this constant drama about the past and it's like they don't want to let the past go either it being obvious but still holding on for for your own reasons so you know ultimately you want freedom or you want entrapment <laughs> honestly look at it that way freedom or entrapment freedom or entrapment Love you guys. Bye.